my name is Radha Masood. Today we will discuss about the topic sensitivity analysis. When today's topic uh, is very important with respect to project management or PMBOK, project management body of knowledge, we will see this topic in detail. What does it mean by sensitivity analysis? Uh, friend, if you are uh, studying project management in university or uh, planning to give exam of EMP, so friend, with respect to exam point of view, uh, this is an important topic and you will see this topic in the exam. Either it's a PMP exam or either it's a project management exam of uh, university level. So uh, you must have to understand the concept of sensitivity analysis. Also friend, if you are a professional project manager and working in any organization as a professional project manager, so again this is, uh, this is a good thing, this is necessary that you have understanding about the sensitivity analysis and how to use in the project management. So friend, uh, let's just start. Uh, we can uh, let's uh, start our tutorial first of all I would request to please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you so let's uh, start sensitivity analysis friends sensitivity analysis means uh, is a tool used in financial modeling to analyze how different values of a set of independent variables affect a specific dependent variable under certain specific condition see friend here this is just a uh, just take it uh, as a definition friend basically sensitivity analysis means that you analyze different factors different uh, past information or historical information about the projects and you can do some prediction about future okay so this is the basically main concept of uh, the concept of sensitivity analysis what you can do for example uh, for example just take it in a, a, as an example like for example if you uh, if you do the uh, sensitivity analysis that for example uh, just take it a, as an example like for example uh, the e-commerce solutions for software solutions of e-commerce generally complete in two months okay however if uh, and if we involve to purchase uh, the software from uh, from third party vendor it can be completed in one month just take it as an example so based on the historical information or past information you can analyze the data and you can do some prediction however there are some factors as well due to that reason it makes it different from other uh, analysis the concept is that uh, basically it depends on two variables uh, the analysis the analysis depends on two variables first uh, dependent uh, first variable is the dependent variable and the second one is the independent variable if you just see the definite name of variables dependent and independent that means one variable which is independent which is not dependent on anything and dependent variable mean that something which is dependent on uh, something let me give you an example of dependent and independent for example uh, you just want to know that uh, how much revenue will be generated from the field uh, if we uh, due to uh, and the field revenue uh, is dependent on on how much rain is there in in a year okay so for example if more rain in a year so revenue from field will also be increased just take it as an example just I want to explain that what is the difference between dependent variable and independent variable so friend here the independent variable is rain rain means that how much rain is there in a year okay so it is an independent year a dependent variable independent variable and revenue from uh, the field by a farmer is dependent variable why because how much rain if rain is increased the uh, the revenue will also be increased if rain is is not there on a field so there will be no revenue from the field so basically revenue from a field of farmer is dependent on the 
uh, is dependent on the rain which we got in a year okay so basically see friend here sensitivity analysis is is a term in which we analyze the data which is based on two variables independent variable and dependent variables and based on that analysis we analyze the past data or historical data and we can predict something some prediction about the future okay so that is the main concept of sensitivity analysis and why sensitivity analysis is different from other uh, other uh, analysis is that sensitivity analysis is based on two variables independent variable and dependent variable independent variable means the variable which is not dependent on anything dependent means that it is dependent on for just remember from the example of rain and the revenue from the field revenue from the field is the dependent why because it depend on something like it depend on the rain and rain is independent because it, dip it doesn't depend on the field rain is totally independent variable okay now friend uh, purpose of sensitivity what is the purpose basically friend sensitivity analysis determines how different values of independent variables affect a particular dependent variable under a given set of assumption this model is also referred to as what if or simulation analysis as well Sen sen sensitivity analysis can be used to help make predictions in the sh share prices of publicly traded companies sensitivity analysis allows forecasting using historical true data friend first of all sensitivity analysis is based on two variables independent and dependent variables based on that we uh, we analyze the data we analyze the past data historical data past projects and after analyzing the data we can predict uh, we can predict we can give forecast about future okay just take it as an example that we can predict about future if we know about the historical data using the uh, analysis of independent and dependent variable the purpose of sensitivity analysis simply the purpose of sensitivity analysis is that based on sensitivity analysis using the independent and dependent variable we analyze the data of past and historical data and based on that we can predict uh, about future we can give forecast about future okay so that is the main purpose of uh, the sensitivity analysis just take an example for example friend uh, john uh, take an example like uh, john is the in charge of sales for abc uh, company a business that sells christmas decoration at a shopping mall john knows that the holiday season is approaching and that the mall will be crowded he wants to find out whether an increase in customer traffic at the mall will raise the total sales revenue of abc and if so then by how much see friend here just take an example that for example up in charge of of abc mall he knows that uh, he just want to know that uh, when there are two variable customer traffic and the revenue he knows that when the customer traffic increase the revenue will also be increased so try to understand customer traffic is independent and revenue is dependent variable there are two variables customer traffic and the revenue from the sale so uh, the what what does that mean by sensitive analysis here means that a person can analyze that from the historical like for example from past five years he can analyze the data that what happen if customer traffic increase what would be the impact on the revenue okay so here the customer traffic uh, in the mall is the independent variable and the uh, revenue is the uh, is the dependent variable so if customer traffic increase by f for example just take an example if customer traffic increase by 10 percent revenue will increase by five percent if customer traffic increase by 20 percent the revenue will increase by 10 percent so after analyzing you are you recognize that if customer traffic increase by the 30 30 percent so revenue will increase by 15 percent so just take an example so based on that 
friend our based on the past data or historical data you analyze and you realize that uh, this is the ratio between the customer traffic and the uh, revenue customer traffic is the independent variable and the revenue is the dependent variable so based on the uh, historical data you can uh, you can say that for example if customer traffic uh, in the to in this year increased by 40 percent so we assume we can predict that we can uh, increase the revenue by 20 percent this is the purpose of sensitivity analysis like we analyze <coughs> that from past years we have noticed that if customer traffic increase so revenue will also be increased if customer traffic increase by 40 percent you are expecting you are forecasting that the revenue from the sale of uh, of the mall will increase by 20 20 percent so you can do you can analyze you can predict about the revenue in that based on that sensitivity analysis so friend thank you thanks a lot for your time and that's all from my side i hope uh, you like this video if you like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thank you thanks a lot for your time and that's all from my side thank you